So now a quick example of another one of the major forms of conditional control flow, the switch statement. And there's no new assembly instructions here, so you should know everything. You've seen eyeballs, subtracts, calls, moves, conditional things. Looks like we've only got some JEs here, otherwise the rest is jumps. JEs because it's checking does it equal exactly zero, does it equal exactly one, and somehow, some way, it's going to make its way to the default case. So all I really want is for you to get more experience stepping through assembly code, understanding the various components, like what is this stuff before the sub RSP? Well, we should know from previous examples. So go ahead and do the example here. So aren't you glad that I'm going to give you another opportunity to step through the assembly code to deepen your experience?